Hmm. So many parts. Just a little time. Although we have all the time in the world. What's going on, YouTube? My name is Diesel, and today we're back. Car Mechanic Simulator 2018, babe. Just hanging out here. Kind of just scoping things out. Kind of looking over the inventory. Things to things to grab. Things that we already have. I was just curious, you know. Ain't no big thing, chicken wing, no I'm saying, but what we got going on right here, right now, today, for you all, my man, Gollywog, has created a fantastic new car. It's on the Steam Workshop. The link is in the description down below. Uh, he's also the creator of the C110, uh, the uh, Skyline, the 73 Nissan Skyline. That is fantastic, only you can't drive this door, it's gonna kill somebody. But, who's a fan of Mad Max? We got ourselves a V8 Interceptor, also known as the Pursuit Special, aka 19, I believe it's a 73? 73 Ford Falcon? 73 Ford Falcon? Ish? Roundabouts? Give or take? Yes. Mad Max. It's the Mad Max car. It's wonderful. So, he's got a lot of interesting parts in the back here. Uh, it's got some, of course, fuel tanks, extra fuel to roll in there in case dog meat needs to get in the back. We also have some dog food. Indeed. It's super, it's super duper nice. Let's hop in the seat here. He's even added, he's even added the gun and, of course, like the, the knife machete. The machete. Got a couple extra gauges in here. We got the left seat in case you need to swing out to murk a fool. And we also have a cage in the back as well. I'll show you that in a second here. Let me see if I can show you. Kind of got a little cage separating the back. It's awesome. Also, these side mufflers here, technically it's considered the front bumper. So it's part of the uh, actual assembly. Now, the only problem is that this muffler, um, they're not really attached to the muffler system. So it's just, it's all aesthetic. But you know what? Let's not worry about it. Let's just enjoy the beauty. Let's enjoy the wonder. It does have a V8 supercharger in it. Um, it's, I got this off the auction house because you can really only find it in the auction house and the junkyard. I have put it into the car salon. I have not found it, but you won't. I have a feeling you don't want to have this thing brand new, and that's not what we're going to be doing either. Everything you see on the outside is going to be OG. I'm not going to do any body. Rest. We're going to keep the rust. That's what I'm going to do. Keeping the rust. I'm keeping the grime. There's no windows. There's no side windows because there's no side windows in Mad Max. Um, but yeah, I'm keeping everything the way it is, so that, that way when we go to paint it, it has that little bit of rust to it. Yes. Gotta keep it authentic. Am I right? I think I'm right. And when I'm right, I'm right. So, let's go ahead and we'll move this joint over to the center. Ah, so badass. It's so badass. Now, everyone has a... Let me know in the comment section down below um, that they enjoy the time lapse. From last episode. I enjoy the time lapse too. I sure do. So that's what we're gonna do here today. We're gonna have uh we're gonna take apart everything. It's basically the same kind of thing. Oh, I mean it's just a supercharger though. It's so dope. It's so nice. I don't think there's gonna be too many parts in here that I will have to replace, but what I wanna do is I'm gonna replace every single piece on the inside, but keep the rustic aesthetic on the outside. I even like the interceptor logo too. Well done, Gollywog. Interceptor. So badass. So, folks, let me hop on in with a grin. Oh, a little jumpiness there. Hop on in with a grin. Let's get this time lapse underway. What do you say? Boom! <laughs>
Okay, so we are all done. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Let me know in the comment section down below. Leave a like, please. I need this. No, seriously. Uh, go ahead if you uh, enjoyed it. Um, so I understand what the people are gonna, probably going to say. Um, one, that the two exhaust pipes don't really match up. Well, these uh, exhaust uh, the pipes that go out the side are technically, like I said, the front bumper. So uh, they cannot connect. Which is fine to me, and I think it's just it's aesthetically pleasing, especially when you just don't even care. You just want to have a my, uh, you just want to have yourself a Mad Max mod. You just want to have a Mad Max car, baby. Mad Max car. It's a fantasy car. It's good stuff. Well, it's not technically fantasy. It's actually like a real car, but like at the same time, it's all good. I also noticed that there's no fuel tank because you have the fuel tanks, <laughs> like the actual tank, in the back, so uh, you don't need to worry about replacing those, which is kind of good. I like that. I like that. I like that. I like. Let's go ahead and put some oil in this John. right here. Um, if you notice in the uh, time lapse, I always seem to like not see the tires and how wide they are. I accidentally put the 245s on the right side and 265s on the left side, so I changed it and made sure the 245s are in the front, 265s are in the back. Because come on, come on, get down with the thickness. I'm down with the thickness, sir. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But everything should be nice, loaded, and rock and rolling. Um, also, what people are probably going to say is that uh, most of the parts that were on here are around like 80 to 90%. There were some parts that were around 72%, mostly like the valve push rods, uh, brake pads, uh, rocker arms, pistons, and the piston uh, rings. But I decided to, uh, you know, just change them all out. Screw it. So we did it. And it's going to be fantastical. So let's go ahead and we'll move this car over to the paint shop. Baby. Now with the mod, it comes with two libraries. And I want to thank Gollywog for doing one of the, well, not just one of both of them, both of them, obviously, but one in general. In case you want to make your own library in like Photoshop or GIMP. If you don't have Photoshop, GIMP is something that does like Photoshop, but uh, Google has made it and it's free. But... He's got two templates in here, two liveries. We got the dirty one, which gives it a little bit of rust and dirt and grime, Mad Max style. Yeah. And then a template. So he actually has in, if you go into your Steam files, uh, Steam streaming assets, cars, and then go into the Mad Max ride. One of the libraries, if you drop that into Photoshop or the GIMP, it actually has a layout. Of uh, where you need to go ahead and paint it. Oh, put your designs here, and you can just go ahead and you can streamline your designs through there. That is something that's so necessary for every single car right now, but it's not. Uh, it's not in there. It's just not in there. We just got to guess and then figure it out. And then once we figure it out, then we can go ahead and kind of line it up. But it's it's still a super pain in the butt. But enough about me. Enough, enough about what I want. You know what I mean? Let's give you guys what you y'all want now. We can't make it shiny, we just can't. And we can't make it any kind of color other than fine. Let's go ahead and grab that template. Get that dirty. Mmm. Mmm mmm. Oh yeah. With that little bit of rust in there, it just adds that extra flavor to it. And we can make it dark, but we kinda wanna I, I kinda wanna make it just a little And then, if you want, you can even add a little bit of like a color. You know, I'll say, where is our orangish kind of tone, ketone? Like, say for instance, there, let's go ahead and we'll just put that there. Right. I think if you just want to zest it up here a little bit. So say we drop, well, we keep the saturation up there, but we bring the darkness down. And you can kind of give it that little bit of extra kind of sun-drenched, muddy, dirty kind of feel to it while adding a little bit of the black in there as well. I like that though. I like that. We shall paint you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's what's up right here. That's what's up. I like you. I like it a lot. 
Now, as far as all of it, yeah, see the vintage tires, rim retro, all the tires, all the uh, actual things that you have visually seen from the outside, they're all dirty. Front exhaust pipes, front left door, hood, body, they're all a little, little dented up, but that's good. It adds a little character to it, and that's what we want. That's what I wanted anyway. So, let's go ahead and we'll take it. No, not to the parking lot. Gosh dang it. Watch out for the door. Go over to our whips. I wish you could select them and then bring them over. In Car Mechanic 2015, you could just select them without going into it and just like bring it over to the garage. But now we have to go into the garage, load it up, grab it, bring it back, and then go drive it. Um, I've already test drove it before, just because I wanted to see if it was drivable. And it's totally drivable. But like most, uh, like most modded cars, only most, it's a little hard to control. <laughs> so we shall see, because I just fixed up the engine and gave it more power. Oh, good for me. I know, right? It's crazy. It's crazy. Oh, you're so badass. Hell yeah. Nice. So, let's go ahead, take it over to the racetrack. Take it for a spin. Let's go take it for a spin, guys. It's gonna be super duper nice. It's gonna be like super duper awesome. And after that, we're gonna go over to my brother's high school soccer game. It's gonna be awesome. Oh, ho, 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 
I have the power! It's so loud in my ears right now. Oh my god. Oh my god! Oh my god! Sorry in my ears! Goodness. Well, we got it and we can't, we're keeping it. <laughs> That's for sure. I'm keeping this for shout. But we need ourselves some license plates. So, I believe someone said that they can make custom license plates now. I'll make two custom play. Uh, see, I don't know if I want to do that. Well, let's just put two of them in there. And we'll put custom one for Mr. Durzo. I'll put Durzo here instead of your full name. Mr. Alex Duncan, thank you so much. Appreciate your Patreonage. Boom. Actually, you know what? I'll put... I'll put... Uh, Alex... Dunk. I don't think... Can I fit? Nah. Nah. How about A dunk. Nice. Purchase you eighteen hundred dollars. It's dropping the pan, sir. Dropping the pan for you. Oh, no problem. License plate. That's fine. Who needs identifying mar uh, markers? I mean, I don't know what the rules are in Australia, but in America, we need two license plates on the front and back. You know what? We're going to keep you. Because you're all kinds of pretty. But folks, that's going to be our episode for today. If you enjoyed this video, by all means, hit that like button. It helps out my channel ever so much more than you know. And if you like it a whole lot, go ahead. Hit subscribe. New videos coming out every single day, every single week. Folks, let's go ahead and move you. I want to move. I want to move. Bye. <laughs> Everyone, have a great day, afternoon, evening, uh, a good night. Oh, shizzle. Hold on here. Got to sell these parts here. There's too many parts. Too many parts over here. I wish this wasn't such a grimy shop. I do like the griminess of it, but I should, uh, like, uh, when we used to be able to customize it, we customize the floors, we customize the, the lifts, we can make everything all colorful, and now we can't. Just expansion. Sad. Sad. Hashtag sad. Oh, we're so close to level, uh, 39, too. I may have to just, uh, grind out a couple, uh, jobs. I finished that job over here, which was a pain in the booty. Uh, what are we got going on here? What's it? Category Casamoto. I'm the victim of a defect. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's this car. That's, that's the problem. The whole thing. Just trade it in. Um, let's see. Separate. 100%. Probably should keep these parts here. But nah, I'm just gonna sell them. Just gonna sell them all. We're gonna sell them all. Inventory. How much money are we gonna make off of these, baby? $3,677. Hey, every little bit helps. But folks, if you enjoyed this video, like I said, hit that like button, helps out my channel so much more than you know. And if you like it a whole lot, go ahead, hit subscribe. New videos coming out every single day, every single week, folks. That door is seriously gonna hurt somebody. Everyone have a great day, afternoon, evening, a good night. Peace out, like shout, y'all. And I'll check you out right here again. Car Mechanic Simulator 2018, baby. Next time, what's the difference between this? Paint car, paint, oh, paint part. Oh, just paint individual parts. Gotcha. Interesting.